Mossman was mine again. Just to been doing some research. And there's typhi typhoid Mary. I'm not sure if any of you have heard about it. But one of my mans of wisdom has pointed me in that direction to do some research on it. And basically in 1873 there was a woman. Well, she was born before then. But the case of what she was doing was found out around 1873. And she got it, but she wasn't affected by it as such. So she went on into, she was from Ireland originally, she went on to America. She was a cook for all these rich people. And it turned out she'd had it and she was carrying it. She was passing it into all the foods through excrements, like your waste and all that, like your back end and all that crap. She was putting it in the foods and the water. And um, yeah, killing off those people basically. And I also come across another bit. And uh, basically, I think it was in the 1900s. So it was like 19, it was like 19, just after the World War II. So like 1940, 1950 era. It was like an Asia flu, I think it was. And um, those people were dying from it. And there was this, this one old lady, she was using a, um, carbonated soda I think it was a teaspoon a day because she was a kid back then she had to go around and make sure everyone had food and that but uh, everyone else was going around and doing everything they were dying but it was only her and her family that was taking this carbonated soda a teaspoon before breakfast every day and they're the only people that survived it in their town so there's a bit of thought for you and that disease with the Asian flu that they had back in the 1950s period um, yeah, it's basically the same as uh, COVID-19. That's strange, isn't it? It attacks you the same way. So your nasals, through the air in your mouth, into your neck, your lungs, chest. Mm. And the only way to dilute it is the same way as COVID-19, which we found to dissolve the acids, things to dissolve acids. That's exactly the same as what the Asia flu was. You have to find things to dissolve the acids. Mm. I'm going to do a longer depth video with some uh, information and the information I found basically just so I can show you it's more in person and in depth and talk about it a bit more just thought I'd take the time just to let you all know I'm still about I was just a little bit busy with family issues and things like that hope you're all doing well and look after one another keep positive and uh, just be aware of what you're eating as well you know there's fruits out there that can help you dissolve these acids. There's like melons, watermelon, bananas. You know, just do a bit of research. Muslims mines. Also check out Panera's mine. Shifadan. Survival mines. Doing chat boards on there and stuff. Alright, peace out, Muslims mind.